click the click the subscribe button click the bell for notifications if it's something in particular you're looking for click that playlist because your girl is a jack of all trades okay all things new a place where i'm free to be me vlogs look but bones Hulk. beauty i'm back i'm back i'm back i'm back i'm back i'm back oh my bad i'm back <laughs> good morning my people eat beliefs people eat beliefs people eat beliefs good morning to you good morning my people eat beliefs people eat beliefs good morning to you good morning everybody i'm back i'm back I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. Y'all see my bun just fall down. I'm trying to get into this food. Oh. Oh. I lost my burn. I lost my burn. <laughs> Y'all know I like the color hair. I'm all about the mermaid life. Anyway, today with breakfast, we have an unboxing, baby. We have an unboxing for you, an unboxing for you. So, I got McDonald's. McDonald's. We got McDonald's. Muck bang, muck biggity bang. I'm about to throw that and do my thing. Muck bang, muck biggity bang. Grab your food chat, eat and hang. Muck bang. Mug biggity bang. Sit, got some chat, eat, chill, and hang. So grab your food, grab your dude, pull it up to the TV, pull it up to your phone, and let's eat and have a little fun, okay? So today I got burritos. <laughs> Breakfast burritos. And I got a hush brown. And I got picante sauce. We gonna make it rain on them with the picante sauce. Okay? And y'all know what else I got? My favorite! And to drink oysters. You gotta get that vitamin C in. Your girl don't wanna be sick. She need all the vitamin C she can get. Oh, brrr. So anyway, let me put my phone up here for how soft it be soft. I'm about to say, where is my napkins? Gotta have the napkins on deck. So, I have a unboxing, y'all. So, <laughs> I'm gonna take my husband's advice and start letting my inter this this be me over here. It's so much y'all don't know about me. I don't had this channel three years. Lord, lying, y'all. I'm about to put on my seatbelt and go. That was one of my kids calling, honey. Who chat? My nerves, my nerves. Cause he got severe asthma. He was calling me. My phone hung up. Child, I'm about to bump out. Anyway, he done about messing my whole vibe. Y'all know how they with them kids be calling, child. You got an Elsie. So here, look, look, this little, this, this, this our little breakfast burrito. It's, it's, it's a little, I mean, let's just say grace. Amen. Okay. So this is the size of our little burrito. Hold, hold your horses. Well, I don't have my string on my glasses right now, so they be falling. I forgot to put the string back on. Just the size of our little burrito. Y'all see it? Just the size. Okay, and we got two of them. So now let's go and get into it. What is today? Today is January the 16th, 2020. Yesterday, which was January the 15th, 2020 was my son's 21st birthday. I'm so proud of my baby. 
I'm putting sauce on here. Let me let me lower the camera. Let me lower and down the camera. Look, my husband said, don't be showing y'all my ugly steering wheel cover, so I can't let the people see that. Oh, that worked right there. Let me try to open this one back. Oh, look at that. Oh, no, no, close that one back. Okay. Anyway, maybe if I just sit back. Maybe not. Let's leave that one closed. Okay. Anyway, let's get into this burrito. Shout out to McDonald's for putting all my sauce in the bag. Cause I like the sauce, it's sauce. I like the sauce. Yep, I do. Y'all hear that train coming? I call it Chattanooga Express. That train run about three times an hour. And then we got, did I give y'all a bite of the burrito? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm greedy. I don't be giving the first bite. I'm sorry, y'all. But I got to taste it for y'all first. Make sure it's not right. Watch it down with a little, Jamie. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm-hmm. I don't feel like it's too dark up in him. Okay. <sighs> I'm sorry I didn't share with y'all, but you girl, I tell y'all was hungry. That intermittent fast is funny how you girl. Uh, yesterday, I got my calorie intake at, at like 1500. Um.
I was hungry this morning. Then I didn't eat after seven. I know I'm gonna eat just after eleven thirty, but today I could I, I I don't make myself suffer, you know. If I'm hungry, I eat. It's about nine thirty now, maybe. I know it ain't ten o'clock in the morning, huh? Huh? I like their breakfast burritos, but I can't get them often because sometimes I don't know if they do anybody else like this, but sometimes they make me sick to my stomach. So I ain't looking at the camera, y'all. When I sit in the park, I like the people watch, so I'm doing. I don't know watching the traffic go by. It looks like it's been raining a lot here in Mississippi. That's what we need to talk about. Let's talk about this. Hold on, I'm supposed to knock the end off my airbus. I'm here in Mississippi. And if y'all ain't heard now, Yo Gotti and, and Jay-Z is suing you win. Uh, Mississippi for the issues with the correctional um, state penitentiary, right? Okay? So, let's talk about it. Y'all gonna y'all want to sue them for the conditions, but this is my thing. Before y'all jumped and hollered, let's sue them because of before y'all jumped and hollered, oh, what? let's sue them for the conditions of, of the Mississippi prison. First thing, let's address is why the prisons are the way that they are. Y'all should have been addressing the gang balance because what made all this come to light about the situation of the prisons is because people was getting killed. Why was people getting killed? Because the gangs are in there fighting. So instead of hollering, let's sue the prison because of the unfair living conditions, why don't you fix why the prison tore up in the first place? The prison tore up because they in there acting a fool and fighting. If you didn't want to be there, don't do the damn crime. But see, this, this is why I'm heated about it. The first thing they should have been addressing is the violence that's going on. It's gang violence. It's why all this was brought to light because people have been killed because it's a big gang rivalry, rival thing going on in the prison. This what they should have been addressing first. Not, we gonna sue them for unliving conditions. It's disgusting. It is disgusting. We seen the pictures of it. I mean, the pictures are horrific, okay? Disgusting when it rains, the toilets back up into to certain certain uh, cell blocks, like sides of the prison. The kit it raining in the kitchen, the ceiling falling down, it's molded and mildew. The the prison does need some repairs, but I'ma tell you this. The inmates also gotta stop tearing the prison up. Y'all down there on a whole plantation, put them y'all I'm about to cuss. They should be down there gardening, planting, they should have their own fruit trees. They should be doing all of that. Y'all should be down there. This is what y'all should be encouraging. Not just holler. Let's just do this, uh, sue the state of Mississippi. Because it is. It's disgusting. Something does need to be done. But I just feel like before they. they the first thing they should have said was. Stop the game violence. No. They going to pat them on the back. Because that's all it's doing is patting them on the back. For in there acting a the fool with this gang rival stuff. Which what brought attention to the prison. Why are you rewarding that? You should have said, you know what? Cut out the foolishness and we'll get something done about your prison. Let's have peace and stop all the gang rivalry. Pull out a Bible. Seek God and pray the right God. Not, not some de demonized God. The correct God. The Father. The Holy Ghost. Jesus. And y'all, it should it have been handled accordingly. I would like that more attention. So let, let's go on and talk about the whole state of Mississippi. So then we got Yandy here. Yandy been here because 20 minutes down the road. Look, my whole.
whole state just in the uproar. 20 minutes down the road, one direction, a little girl was killed by a woman that was that passed the school bus. The woman didn't get no time for it. So the problem here in Mississippi is had she been a black woman hitting a black child, she'd have went to prison. But because she was a white woman hitting a black child, there was no time done for it. Then here we go last year, a white boy hits a white child, he in prison for it. So Yandy, Al Sharpton, and other people are here. They had a protest in our state capital, which is Jackson, Mississippi. That's about four hours for me. Uh, um, if you've been following me for a long time and you own all of my social media, y'all know we are in Jackson, Mississippi a lot because um, that's where we go for my dad's chemo and like his major treatments. We have to go there to the university hospital. And so we there a lot and you know, we live in the residential inn for a month or so, whatever. And that's also the home of the dancing doll. So yeah, you see me there a lot because I'm a dancing doll fan, BD4L for life. Anyway, so they down there for that. I would rather more attention be shined on that than the prison situation. The prison situation is messed up, but you do not glorify their bad behavior. Not only that, 20 minutes in another direction, Ray Schremer and them stepdad was killed. So my whole state for the, the this month is on something. I don't know. Normally Mississippi pretty quiet. We minding our own business. Then we're going to go a whole nother hour in another direction. Hour, an hour and a half in another direction. The dam about to break. People finna lose their homes. Pray for the state of Mississippi, okay? Pray for the state of Mississippi. It is one of the lower states. Because we don't have very intelligent people running it. But in all honesty, we like being a lower state for some of us because it keeps things, the cost of things cheap and low. And it keeps it very peaceful here. So we ain't mad about that. It keeps it quiet, it keeps it peaceful, it keeps it nice. We have wildlife, vegetation, and when too, too much start coming in, they clean out all the trees, they take away all the natural environment stuff, they run off all the animals, and then it just becomes more, another state contributed to global warming. So we are proud of our state because our state contributes to healthy air and natural wildlife and all that kind of stuff. So anyway... I had to just go on and touch on that right quick because it's just done got out of hand, out of hand, out of hand. So, now that this video done got that long, I might as well do my unboxing a whole nother video. Oh, snap. No God, honey. No God. No God. Okay. And so, the inmates complaining about the conditions. They they got they got smuggled in cell phones and <laughs> they taking pictures of the prison and how it is and how nasty it is and sending it to family members who sending it to the media. Well, somebody done got caught or somebody they figured out who somebody was with the phone. Well, they done figured out they figured out who one of the persons one of the people were with a cell phone. An inmate taking pictures of the conditions in the inside, sending the family member who was giving them to media. How about they gave him 12 years for having a cell phone? Now, on top of his sentence, he got 12 more years because he illegally had the cell phone. But they don't have no other way to contact the family or nothing. Like I said, the